extremely fun to watch and it started on the defense then then they got their alley-oops they got everything rolling but they started with getting stops and that's a good little start from Krizlovic way to break that zone looking looking finds Froling guarded by Oliver one-on-one -on -one. the young lefty wants to back in uses the little jump hook to perfection and the finesse game is firing at all cylinders early in the end danced and went nowhere Shot clock at 10. Harvey's just going to let it go from the Kmart. We watched it 10 days ago. They kick it back out to him. Man. Hand down, man down. And now with the last shot of the quarter. You see the clock there down the five. Jessup lets it go. The left is oh. down. No better way to end the quarter for the Hawks. Well, a sharp shooter, but defensively they have struggled. That man, Justin in Jessup, he loves the step. <laughs> Oh, it has, and, and Brian Gorgian loves it. I tell you what, I'm ready to play after listening to a Gorge speech. He said, we love this, baby. We're 11 deep. We're volume as Machado got the tough bucket inside. Quite happy the master is with how his trips are going, boys. A lot of NBL1 teams. He is pricked up with uh, Trigger talking about a possible comeback. As Isaac White knocks a little through. He's got the last five points. And again, the lead is back to seven. Dow, a defensive struggle early, but this man getting hot. A sharpshooter got a wide open three ball, and then that makes that contested one where he was high enough in rhythm because he's already found it. It's a good little out of bounds play now. Knocks down that mid range. When he gets going offensively, this team is going to go to a whole nother level. That's the thing. Here is Jerry. She called for a Pete Hawley, and Kayan Stein bats Mike Kelly and Mirko Jerry. And he's not been able to penetrate and get to the rack like he usually does. Rolling is as pure as a cucumber right now. Took his time, knew the shot clock. Transition D again early in the third quarter in concern. Here's Oliver. One-on-one -on -one with Ogilvy. Step back, 17 footer. Great D by Ogilvy. Better offense by Cam Oliver. We only had the fingertip at home. Couldn't quite get it. Now it's Ding and Dell. Great pass. Ding ding. Got it. Kisses it off the window. Over Cam Oliver, and that'll deflate the Stag Pit fans. After season. Oh, oh, my goodness. Came from nowhere. We spoke about Marve kick at half time. Kenny put it up. Stag <laughs> Pit's rocking trigger your court side. Where did you poke your head in a three quarter time? I was down at Mike Kelly's huddle, but it was a lot of Cam Oliver as. Jessup gets a layup to break the heart of the tight ends early. Eight point lead for the Hawks. Nine minutes to go, fourth quarter. I won't say I hope you're enjoying this one because Justinian Jessup is making sure we all enjoy it. This man ripped it apart in the first quarter. Tight ends trying to break this losing streak. And Justinian Jessup on the step back. That is unguardable. They gave it to Sam Froling and he just went to work. Oh. And then that happens. <laughs> And then that happens. You see Harvey gets open. All he needs is Jessup. Next start be next start. Oh my. That's the ultimate heat check, but it leads to a wide open Harvey. And you can almost shut the gate. I know they gave themselves. Let's have a little look. Little up fake. Machado goes flying. Harvey goes. They never missed the playoffs with that type of start in franchise history. Can they go four and zero? This man thinks they can with a floater oh, like oh, that. Oh, oh, Who's to argue with him? Five of seven from downtown. Big night. It's over. A little bit of a weird ending, but it is over, and it's a 20-point win <laughs> for the.